Did you want to say something? Vitaly Golubev, Rovna, chief editor of the publishing house OGO. First of all, I think about 90% of the audience are thinking, why the heck are we discussing this at all? We should be much more interested in the Verkhovna Rada of Ukraine and not Russia's Duma. I would think that, rather than Rada declaring the Russian elections illegitimate, millions of Ukrainians would gladly declare Rada itself to be illegal. To kick out all these clowns, liars and demagogues who are fighting, physically boxing with each other in parliament over who gets to rob our country. I have to say that there will be no patriotism, no respect for our states, when thousands more Ukrainians every day have to leave to look for work in Russia. While you here are chatting about Putin's party winning elections, those Ukrainians no longer consider Russia to be an aggressor. For them, Russia is a new home. And the aggressor for them is the new Ukrainian regime, which has destroyed businesses and factories, which has legislated ruinous ut utility tariffs. And today, many thousands of Ukrainians are bringing real money back from Russia so that their families wouldn't starve here in Ukraine. And they don't have a problem with Russian Duma election results. And the people are marveling at you, esteemed members of parliament, arguing about a law on the special elections in Donbass. You say, if we allow them to have special elections, then bandits will get elected there. So what? Aren't government composed of bandits here? Our parliament is already full of bandits. Only bandits there kill at the front lines, and the bandits here are killing Ukraine from the inside, via corruption, by shutting down factories to quickly sell them for scrap, by refusing to have reforms. Those bandits are just the same as DLPR, only the lack of weapons makes them more dangerous because they are attacking from the inside. It's our Ukrainian Putin, usurping power from the people. Esteemed members of parliament, please explain to me, why don't we have healthcare reform for two and a half years? It's because you're squabbling over control of insurance companies. Why don't we have a law on amber? Because the other parties are squabbling over mining. Why are you busy chatting about this or that political party losing elections in Russia? Verkhovna Rada is stealing Ukraine from under us. So, for the people to respect our government and for the Ukrainians to be proud of their country, you need to start caring about wages, pensions, standards of living of common people. Make laws that would allow people to live with dignity in their own country instead of going to foreign aggressors to survive. And if Ukraine can become a place where people can have a good life, then people can be proud of their country and government.